can heal, but did you know some of those healing factors can be used to turn back the clock? Dr. Bill Johnson of Innovations Medical is here to tell us how. Hello, Bill. Good morning. This is why you're Innovations Medical, because it's so innovative, what we're talking about here today. We try. Yeah, well, this is cutting edge stuff. What is it? Well, what we're talking about, we've known for a long time that our body uses special messengers that are called growth factors to initiate and promote the healing process. But a few years ago, we started using that a little bit to help in bad wounds or in orthopedic injuries that wouldn't heal. It's been real difficult to get those factors in a concentrated manner affordably mm -hmm. until just recently. And now there's a new FDA process that produces a substance called platelet-rich plasma, or PRP, that allows us to do that. Okay, what is PRP exactly and how do we get it? Well, PRP is from, we get from your blood. So we'd actually draw your blood mm -hmm. and we take this FDA approved device called the Harvest System and we put the blood in there and it separates out the platelets which contain most of the growth factors. We can then resuspend that and we have about four to seven times the amount of growth factors in that platelet rich plasma or PRP that we have generally in our blood. Okay, so what do these growth factors do? Well, we've got a slide that shows all the things that they do. What they are required to, for the body to begin the healing process. In particular, we're interested in what they do with fat transfer because they actually allow the cells that we activate with PRP to call in their own blood supply. It actually allows them to call in the cells they need to build a support structure in their new home uh -huh. and it stimulates the stem cells within the fat that's been transferred so you can actually grow new fat in that area. Well, it sounds like they're sending little text messages and you're kind of signaling back. That's, that's a really good example. I bet you've they never are. heard it said that way before. Yeah, it's it's that, a good analogy though. It does. It sounds very effective that way. Okay, how does PRP and um, how, help with uh, fat and anti-aging? Well, one of the big factors that our faces in particular age with is we lose fat, especially here in our cheeks and upper and around our eyes. And when we can take and put the fat back where it was, fat represents the perfect filler. There, it's you. There's no way to react to it. It also has, uh, ex is replacing exactly what we've lost. So the issue has become how do we put the fat in and keep it? And PRP is the next step in assuring fat survival in where it's now been transferred to. So making an effective process even more effective. Correct. And long-term effectiveness. And long-term effectiveness. Which effectiveness. Is, we want the short-term effective because we like the instant gratification of looking younger, but we want it to stay that way. And they do. Okay. How about body shaping? How does it introduce here? Well, when we use fat to do a Brazilian lift where we lift the buttocks using your fat or when we use fat to do breast augmentations, mm -hmm. the fat survival again is the key. And by adding PRP, we can increase the amount of cells that survive and enhance the ultimate result. Fascinating. Any specials for GMT viewers? Well, with this introduction on PRP, we're giving 20% off all fat transfer cases for the next two weeks. Woohoo! We like 20% off. Thanks, Bill. And for more information about new beginnings, log uh, 2010, log on to innovationsmedical.com or give them a call, 972-331-8844 for a consultation. And if you have questions for Dr. Bill Johnson, just drop them an email at questions at innovationsmedical.com. Good stuff. Over to you, Rob.